Electric cars are the future and each year we have seen new and fresh EVs arriving in the market. In today's video, we are going to take a look at every electric vehicle from concept to production that is arriving soon in 2023. Stay tuned to know more. Chevrolet Equinox EV Last year, Chevy sold 165,232 of its Equinox crossover, beating Ford Escape, Honda Pilot, Hyundai Tucson, and Subaru Forester. It wishes to continue this success with an Equinox EV that should start around $30,000 and go on sale in the fall of 2023. Range and battery size details are not available, but we can expect around 300 miles of range to be competitive on the market. Audi A6 e-tron The Audi A6 e-tron is a concept for now, but Audi claims that it's super close to what the production car will look like. It's based on the scalable premium platform electric architecture that can be expanded lifted and magnified for a lot of different EV models. It will be sold with the gas-powered A6 and it's possibly the first EV we'll see on the PPE platform that underpins future electric Audis. The A6 e-tron concept uses two electric motors with a joint output of 469 horsepower. All PPE cars have 800 volt charging capacity and this big sedan could have as much as 40 miles of range on a single charge. Faraday Future FF91 the Faraday Future FF91 once looked like it was going to make big waves, but will it ever reach production? This is a really big question. We first saw the FF91 at CES 2017 and the startup then revealed the car was production ready. Most recently, a model was seen testing at its production plant in Hanford, California. It breaks a 1050 horsepower from two rear-mounted electric motors and an available front-mounted motor. Faraday Future also claims that the big crossover can blast from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.4 seconds. A 130 kilowatt hour battery pack built in partnership with LG Chem is meant to provide an estimated 378 mile range. Chevrolet Silverado EV Turns out the GMC Hummer EV and SUV were a small taste of what we'll see from Chevy's upcoming all electric Silverado. They'll be manufactured under the same roof with the Silverado also using GM's Ultium battery pack and offering up to 400 miles on a single charge. The Silverado EV will be offered from a fleet-oriented work truck trim to exclusively loaded RST models with 664 horsepower. In an effort to make good on its promise of 30 new EVs by 2025, production of Chevy's first electric pickup will start this year. Before we move ahead, if you're liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking this video. Now, let's continue. Ford Explorer EV The Ford Explorer EV is among the most prominent SUVs sold in the US, so putting on the fully electric treatment is a positive move. Ford announced that its three-row SUV would be joining the Mustang Mach-E and the E-Transit electric van in Ford's rising electric lineup. But the present Explorer offers a 318-horsepower hybrid V6 powertrain. And there are a lot of people who doubt that, like with the Mach-E and F-150 Lightning, there are rear and all-wheel drive Explorer EV models. GMC Sierra EV GMC plans to build the Sierra EV pickup with the Hummer EV and Chevrolet Silverado EV at Factory Zero in Michigan. Before that, we only have news as to what the GMC truck might be. Like with gasoline additions, you can expect the Sierra to have unique styling inside and out, but otherwise be mechanically similar to the Silverado EV. This means it's also going to share the Silverado EV's fixed glass roof and rear wheels steering setup. Tesla Roadster The Tesla Roadster's second generation has been confirmed for 2023. It has around 0 to 60 miles per hour time of 1.9 seconds, an 8.8 second quarter mile time, and a top speed of 250 miles per hour. The Roadster will have an all-wheel drive system with a pair or maybe even three electric motors with a 200 kilowatt hour battery pack. It can provide this two-door with a range of up to 620 miles. We also expect the starting price to be around $200,000, which is a nice price if the Roadster can live up to the performance claims. FinFast VF8 and VF9 FinFast sold around 30 vehicles in Vietnam. The firm has not made a major profit but is quickly growing in Vietnam. It has become the fourth most popular car brand in the last year, with an 8.3% share of the market. Now, the organization has announced plans to expand into North America and Europe with the purpose of starting sales in the United States in March 2022. The automaker's global lineup will be centered around electric crossovers. The Vietnamese brand's entry to the US market will be based on the upcoming VF8 and VF9, small and mid-sized electric crossovers. 
Jeep Wrangler EV. Jeep sells a plug-in hybrid Wrangler for XE, but the firm has now teased a fully electric edition of the iconic Wrangler off-road SUV. Jeep revealed a Magneto concept as part of the Easter Jeep Safari, but has also released more information. On the surface, it looks like your normal two-door Wrangler Rubicon, but inside the Magneto has four battery packs with a collective output of 285 horsepower. Jeep also teased a video of a hiking adventure that shows the Wrangler EV driving itself to the end of the trail that give its holders a ride back. Don't get too excited as this is not verified news, but we are expecting the production model to arrive in 2023 with full autonomous features by 2030. What's your take on this topic? Let us know in the comment section below. With that being said, it's time to end our today's video. Press the like button and subscribe to our channel for more interesting stuff. Peace out.